डिवाइड बाई वन प्लस आई मल्टीप्लाय मल्टीप्लाय विथ अवर थीअरी दिट इज रेसनलेसन ऑफ अवर डिविजन टर्म इयर प्लस साइन देन पुट इयर माइनस साइन सो अवर रिजल्ट देट बिकम्स मल्टीप्लाय विथ वन माइनस इनवर्स साइन सो वन माइनस आई एंड डिवाइड सेम टर्म सो दीस बिकम्स अवर ओरिजिनल इक्वेशन दिट इज एज इट इज नाउ अगेन वी वॉन्ट टू मल्टीप्लाय न्यूमिनेटर टर्म एंड मल्टीप्लाय विथ डिनोमिनेटर टर्म सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू मल्टीप्लाय सेवंटी एट माइनस फोर्टी आई मल्टीप्लाय विथ वन माइनस आई सो रिजल्ट देट इज सेवंटी एट इंटू वन सेवंटी एट इंटू माइनस आई सो माइनस आई सेवंटी एट अगेन माइनस फोर्टी आई मल्टीप्लाय विथ वन एंड अगेन माइनस फोर्टी आई मल्टीप्लाय विथ माइनस आई सो फर्स्ट स्टेप देट बिकम सेवंटी एट इंटू वन देट बिकम सेवंटी एट सेवंटी एट इंटू माइनस आई सो टेक माइनस फर्स्ट एंड देन सेवंटी एट इंटू आई नाउ माइनस फोर्टी आई मल्टीप्लाय विथ वन सो माइनस फोर्टी आई नाउ अगेन माइनस फोर्टी आई मल्टीप्लाय विथ माइनस आई सो हियर माइनस एंड हियर माइनस देट बिकम्स प्लस साइन फर्स्ट फोर्टी आई एन आई दिट रिजल्ट इज फोर्टी आई स्क्वेर डिविजन ऑफ वन प्लस आई एन वन माइनस आई यूजिंग अवर सेट ऑफ थियरी सजेस्ट देट टेक डायरेक्टली मल्टीप्लीकेशन ऑफ ए प्लस बी एन ए माइनस बी फॉर्म दिट इज नथिंग बट ए स्क्वेर माइनस बी स्क्वेर सो वी कैन राइट रिजल्ट हियर ए स्क्वेर दिट इज वन स्क्वेर टेक माइनस साइन b square that is nothing but i so b square so i square now again we want to simplify our numerator term and then we want to simplify our denominator term so our numerator term that become 78 and look at here this 40 i square our rule suggests that replace i square by minus 1 so i square by minus 1 so 78 as it is but i square that is replaced by minus 1 so minus 1 into plus that becomes minus and 40 that is as it is so 78 and minus 14 but here middle term and third term that is minus 78 and minus 40 so our result that is 8 that is nothing but addition say minus 78 and minus 40 So eight that is as it is, and seven plus four that becomes eleven. But sign that is negative because of the both the term that is having a minus sign. So minus one one eight i divided by here one square that is one minus sign as it is i square value that is nothing but minus one. Same way here i square that is replaced by minus one. so again our set of theory suggests that if i square then replace by minus 1 now again we want to simplify our numerator and denominator so our numerator and denominator that becomes here 78 minus 40 so 78 and minus 40 minus 118 i so 78 minus 40 that becomes 38 Minus one one eight divided by here one minus minus one so minus one into minus that becomes plus so plus one so one plus one now again we want to simplify our numerator and denominator term so thirty eight minus one one eight i divided by one plus one that result that is two now two that is apply both the side. 38 divided by 2, so our result that is 19. Minus sign that is take as it is. 118 divided by 2, so our result that is 59. I that is as it is, and take a minus sign here as it is. So we can say that our final answer that is 19 minus 15, uh, 59 I. So 19 that becomes our x, and 
i multiply with 59 so our result that is y so we can say that what is the value of our x so x that is nothing but 19 and what is the value of y that is minus 59 so our y that is minus 59 so in this way we can simplify our second term now again we want to move to our third equation find the value of x and y in x and y equation that is x plus i 4 y is equal to i x plus y plus 3 in this type of equation we want to first simplify again so what is our question so we can write our question first find the value of x plus x and y and our question that is x plus i 4 y is equal to i x plus y plus 3 so in this type of equation we want to first simplify or we can say that take all the right hand side value to left hand side so x plus i 4y as it is and we want to simplify i x that is right hand side so if we apply rule then that becomes minus i x here plus y that becomes minus y here plus 3 that becomes minus 3 and sign here is equal to no any term that is remaining here that becomes 0 so now again we want to simplify our this equation so what is the value that is take first without i value that is x here without i that is minus y here without i that is minus 3 so just simplify it x minus y minus 3 now we want to simplify i 4 y minus i x take a common i so plus i i that is common from both the term so i 4 y here plus sign with i that is value common so here minus x is equal to 0 now we want to compare both the term with left hand side value compare with right hand side value but right hand side that is nothing but 0 only so we can easily see that x minus y minus 3 is equal to 0 so x minus y minus 3 is equal to 0 now compare with i value to right hand side i value so no any i value here so finally we can easily write 4y minus x again is equal to 0 so we have two set of equation this is nothing but equation number one and this is nothing but our equation number two two set of equation and we have two variable x and y so we can say we want to easily find out two value x and y <coughs> how so first of all we want to take a common from first equation take a common of y so y is equal to x minus 3 so if we want to value we want to find out the value of y so our y that is left hand side that is goes to right hand side so that becomes y and remaining term that is x minus 3 so our result that is x minus 3 now substitute this y value to our equation number 2 so our y value that becomes 4 replace y by x minus 3 so our equation that becomes x minus 3 minus x that is as it is is equal to 0 that is as it is now simplify this equation that is nothing but 4x 4 into 3 that is nothing but minus 12 because here minus 3 minus x that is as it is is equal to 0 now subtract 4x minus x that becomes 3x 
minus 12 is equal to 0. Now again we want to more simplify 3x minus 12. So 3x is equal to 12. Left hand side of minus 12 they want to go to right hand side that becomes sign that is changed. So 12. Now again we can say that here 3 that is multiply with x that is divide by 12. So our x that becomes 4. So our x value that is 4. So our x value that is 4 we want to substitute y is equal to x minus 3 equation. So y is equal to replace x by 4. So 4 minus 3. So our y value that is 1. So <coughs> using this way we can find both the value x and y. So we can write x is equal to 4 and then y write y is equal to 1. So this is our result or our answer using this equation x plus i 4 y is equal to i x plus y plus 3. Now we want to move to our next question that is find the value of x and y if our value that becomes x divided by 1 minus i plus y divided by 1 plus i is equal to 1 plus 3i. So first of all we want to write our question that is x divided by 1 minus i plus y divided by 1 plus i is equal to 1 plus 3i. Now if our equation that is look like this way then we want to first of all take LCM of our question. So our LCM that is nothing but 1 minus i and then 1 plus i. So first value that is x multiply with 1 plus i. <coughs> so that is nothing but 1 plus i plus y value that is as it is multiply with 1 minus i is equal to 1 plus 3i multiply with 1 minus i and 1 plus i now again we want to simplify our above equation so x that is multiply with 1 so result that is x again x that is multiply with i so result that is i x plus here y that is multiply with 1 so result that is y and y that is multiply with i so result that is minus i y is equal to 1 plus 3i that is as it is here 1 minus i and 1 plus i so this equation that is nothing but a plus b and a minus b so result that is a square that is 1 square minus b square that is i square so we want to simplify that is nothing but x plus i x plus y minus i y is equal to 1 plus 3i here 1 square that is 1 here i square that is minus 1 so minus minus plus now again we want to simplify x plus y here i x and minus i y so take a common of i so i here x minus y is equal to 1 plus 3i 1 plus 1 that is 2 now again more simplify x plus y plus i x minus y is equal to 2 into 1 that is 2 3i into 2 that is nothing but 6i now again 
we want to simplify our equation that is transfer all the right hand side term to left hand side term so our result that becomes x plus y 2 that is nothing but minus 2 plus i here x minus y that is as it is plus 6 i that is transfer and becomes minus 6 i so minus 6 i no any term that is remaining here so 0 so <coughs> again we want to simplify x plus y minus 2 plus i x minus y and then minus 6 because take a common i from our last term that is minus 6 i result that is minus 6 again is equal to 0. Now we want to compare this equation left hand side to right hand side and again left hand side to right hand side know any value in right hand side so we can easily write x plus y minus 2 is equal to 0 so first of all we want to write x plus y minus 2 is equal to 0 and then we want to write x minus y minus 6 is equal to 0 now again we want to take x is equal to minus y plus 2 so take x here is equal to plus y that becomes minus y minus 2 if you want to transfer to right hand side that becomes plus 2 so minus y plus 2 now replace this x value to our second equation that is x minus y minus 6 so replace x by minus y plus 2 so here minus y here plus 2 there is nothing but replace x minus y that is as it is minus 6 that is as it is is equal to 0 here minus y and here minus y so our result that is minus 2y here plus 2 and minus 6 so our result that is minus 4 because of 6 sign that is minus or bigger term sign that is minus so result that is minus 4 is equal to 